turned to stone when I heard the news. When you decide to It's good, y'all. It's your boy Kate Thack, City Nights INC. Now you know, aka the blog killer. Now you know I couldn't let a couple days go by without talking about the situation with um this Plaxico Burgess guy from um the New York Giants. You know, hometown team, New York. Um, but what is wrong here? What's what's the what's the problem with this equation? You know what I mean? Um, athletes for a long time now have been getting themselves in trouble. But one thing, um, me and somebody was actually talking about the other day was that um, before being an athlete, before being somewhat of a public figure, all of these people, men, women, are just m men and women period they're man or woman first and you know they do make stupid mistakes and i'm not i'm not saying it's a mistake like oh he should be forgiven or whatever the case may be because in his case i i think i would agree with a certain reporter that said you know he was trying to be tough trying to be the tough guy rolling with a piece and everything like that and um i totally agree with that because like like another reporter said you know it's not like he was out there fighting crime or anything like that or um, defending his house, you know. I mean, I definitely, you know, I am somewhat agree with people, you know, their right to bear arms. But it's just like, you know what, you're going to a public place. You're a person that definitely makes over probably $5 million a year. Um, and it just makes, it makes absolutely no sense to me at all, um, this situation that this young brother has put himself in because... Now it's just bringing to surface a whole lot of other dumb mistakes that a lot of a lot of other athletes has made. Every every going going from names like OJ to Spreewell to Marion Jones, even Joe Namath like got in trouble back in the day. Um, Lawrence LT, Lawrence Taylor, um, um, Adam Pacman Jones, you got heard about him. Michael Vick definitely in the news. Um, Jamal Lewis, Ray Lewis, um, Leonard Little, and I'm not even a sports fan, but I just know all of these names from research that I've done and just hearing about them. Um, Jason Williams, if y'all remember that back in the day, like he killed a guy. You know what I mean? Um, it's just like stupid mistakes by you know people that just have have so much and when there's people you know back in the hoods and and you know the low low income neighborhoods and everything like that that have nothing that somehow or another fly straight you know what i mean but it's like these overnight you know millionaires or whatever don't know what to do with themselves other than act crazy and um it's kind of wild that 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 happens but um you know i mean what can i say the guy made a dumb move and if those of you that are um, listening that are not in New York, one gun gets you three and a half years. Three and a half years. So three and a half years because you wanted to be a tough guy and you make so much money that I guess you can't afford a bodyguard. And um, you're rolling with a bunch of dudes that are either your size or bigger, but somehow or another you needed a gun. Come on, Plax, man. You're killing me right now. You are absolutely killing me because I just don't believe you. Even going back to names like Daryl Strawberry. Come on. You know what I mean? I mean, this is an absolute situation that is setting us back once again as, you know, not as a people, just as kind of like men, you know. It's just like, you know, you would never see Lisa, Lisa Leslie carrying a gun to go to a club or anything like that. Any of these female athletes, you know. But um, this is just one of those situations in which, like, I want to really see the outcome to this. I want to see if he's going to get a slap on the wrist or he's not. You know what I mean? Because um, to make it even worse, he shot himself. What's going on with that? Pulling a straight, you know, eight-mile move. I forgot the kid's name. Oh, Bob. MC Bob. He pulled an MC Bob and shot himself. So it's really um, a situation I really want to see play out because... This was just straight up ridiculousness, and um, people, we we gotta we gotta get better about this. Um, I gotta reply back about people wanting to know more about the DC Comics um, um, versus Mortal Kombat game. I'm gonna hit you guys with a blog about that a little bit later this week. But um, yeah, this is um, an absolute crazy situation, um, and you know I just wish him the best. But you know, should he have to pay for you know his mistakes? I think so. So on that note, I mean, tell me how y'all feel. You know, hit me up. Y'all know where to find me. You know, Facebook, MySpace, 
you know, um, citynightsinc.com backslash blog. And um, these are about to come through, too. Um, I'm about to throw these into podcasts, too. So check those out, too. I'll let you all know when they're coming through on a podcast so you know you can rock with me on your iPod, too. All right? So until then, stay warm out there, people, and um, be safe. All right? Talk to you all later. Peace.